Yo, what's up everyone? Today I'm here to talk to you about the TikTok Live Stream Key Generator for OBS. This Stream Key Generator also uses the Streamlabs API. So what does that mean? This means that you can create a Stream Key to use through OBS without being suppressed by the algorithm. You won't need an agency to get a Stream Key and you don't need more than a thousand followers to stream on TikTok anymore. So I'm gonna show you all about this. Let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that you're going to need to do is get access to go live on TikTok. And like I said, you don't need a thousand followers to do this as you previously did. So I'll post a link for this down in the chat below where you can go and request access to TikTok live. And if this method doesn't work for you, I'll leave a Twitter post that will show you another way you can try and request access to TikTok live through TikTok itself. So the first thing you're going to do is log in to apply. And then once you log in, you can hit apply or it'll tell you if your access is approved. Once your access is approved, we are ready to go on to the next step. So for this to work, you're gonna have to have Streamlabs desktop installed. You won't need to be running it, but you do need to have it installed on your computer and logged into your TikTok account. So if you don't have Streamlabs desktop, uh, go to the Streamlabs website and you can download it and install it. Uh, I'm not gonna show you how to do that today. There's other videos out there that can show you that one. So once you have Streamlabs desktop open, what you're going to want to do is click on the little icon down here, the little person, you click on that and you're going to want to log in with TikTok. You want to be logged in with your TikTok for this to work. So click that. Once you're logged in, you can click the settings, the little gear down here, and you can see that I am logged in with my TikTok account right here. So once that's good to go, you can click done and close Streamlabs. The next thing you're going to need to do is download the key generator, which is right here. Um, I'll put a link again for you as well down below. And now what you're going to want to use is you don't want the generator debug, you want the release. Uh, if you have Linux or Windows, you pick which one is necessary to you. Most of you will probably use this one. Streamlabs, TikTok, Stream Key Generator, release dash win dot zip. So go ahead and click on that to download it. Okay, once you have that downloaded, you're going to have to extract it using something like uh, WinRAR or 7-Zip. 7-Zip is a free program that you can use to extract files if you don't have one. So just right click on it and extract it. For this to work, you're gonna have to run the Streamlabs TikTok key generator as an admin. So right click on it, go properties, compatibility, and select run as an administrator, apply. I recommend keeping the zipped package in here too because this isn't a super stable release. Uh, sometimes running the program here, it will disappear. And if that happens, then all you gotta do is right click and extract again. So the next thing we're gonna do now is launch the Streamlabs TikTok stream key generator program. Now, um, it says error loading config file. Ignore this if it's your first time running the program or you have never saved the config file before. So what we wanna do is click load token. And as you can see, that pulled up my TikTok username right here, my Pigowski TikTok. And it shows that my Streamlabs application status is approved. So I can go live is true. Perfect. Once we have all that, we can move to the next step. So what you wanna do here is set your stream title and your game. So for game, I'll put um, Diablo 4. And for stream title, we will use um, new best love Beatrix expansion for the new expansion pack for that. And then after this, what we can do is you can hit save config and that will save uh, your token loader as well as the stream details here for every time you need to do this. Now, when you uh, are ready to go live, what you're gonna wanna do is hit go live and that will create a uh, stream URL and a stream key for you. Now, once you have the stream URL and the stream key, we can head back to OBS to set up your stream. Okay, so we're here in OBS and I'm not going to show you how to set up the vertical canvas or the multi-stream today. I have other videos on how to do that and I will just post them in the description down below if you don't have uh, your multi-stream set up. So now what we wanna do is, I've already got my TikTok uh, multi-stream set up here. So I need to go to my settings, go to vertical canvas TikTok, and where it says output settings, this is where I will now copy that server and that stream key that I've got from here. And one thing to notice, you are gonna have to do this every time you wanna go live. You'll have to open up the stream key generator and hit go live, copy and paste the URL and the key into here. Then you can save your output. And then once you're ready to go live on TikTok, you just hit the little green button here and you will be live. Uh, the only thing I other, other thing I would recommend is to find some way to combine your chats. There's other applications out there, something like Caster Labs or the Stream Elements Doc. So uh, there's definitely other tools out there to combine your chat, but that is how you go create your own stream key to go live from OBS. And there we have it. 
just like that, you can stream on TikTok from OBS with no restrictions, no algorithm suppression. You don't need a thousand followers and you don't need uh, an agency to get a key for you. So I hope you enjoyed. Let me know how this goes and good luck. If you have any questions, drop them down below and I'll try to get to them as soon as I can for you. Bye.